part 3 alright afternoon edition series mabay ni vlog <coughs> so kung naan ay mag magtingog na kuan announcer before ang start sa misa diya sa simbahan mag stop mag stop sa yunta sa tuang or mag stop sa yunta sa tuang study time aron respeto na po sa tuang misa diri ana english mass na daily mass or afternoon mass so or kwan sa weekday mass 4 pm ang start dire so so sharo guys nga mura koto ba tag 4 pm may ngala something okay so asa na gani ko Mobile OS designed for handheld devices with limited resources. Example, Android and then iOS. Unsa nang iOS? Mo ba nang Apple? Apple OS siguro? Adi di di ay iPhone OS. iPhone OS na siya. All right. Naatay comparison and contrast. So, kining batch OS unsa iyang features? Iyang Processes jobs in batches, no user interaction. Unsa ba'y advantages? Efficient for bulk processing. Disadvantages: dili siya user friendly. Slow ka ayo ang turn around sa time. Applications: large scale data processing systems. Next, multi programming OS. Features: executes multiple programs concurrently. Sharing CPU advantages improves CPU utilization. Ang iyang disadvantages multitasking ay limited multitasking, complex resource management, and then ang applications is early mainframe systems. Next, multitasking OS features allow multiple tasks to run. Simultaneously on a single CPU. Advantages: user-friendly, efficient for interactive use. Disadvantages: overhead for managing multiple tasks, applications, modern desktop operating systems. For example, Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Next, multi-processing OS features. Supports multiple processors for parallel execution. Advantages: significant performance improvement for complex tasks. Disadvantages: increased hardware cost, complexity in programming, and then young applications, high performance servers, super computers. Wow. Next, distributed OS features manages multiple computers as a single system. This at a Next is advantages: scalability, resource sharing across network. Disadvantages: complexity in managing distributed resources. Next, applications, cloud computing platforms. Okay. Next is real-time OS features guarantees timely response to events. Advantages: critical for time-sensitive applications. Disadvantages: limited flexibility, resource constraints, applications, medical equipment, industrial control systems. Next, mobile OS features designed for handheld devices with limited resources. Advantages: user friendly and then power efficient and then disadvantages: limited processing power, storage capacity. Applications: smartphones, tablets, Android, and then iPhone OS. Okay. So, sa ako ang nabantayan dere, natay dua ka buok OS na user friendly, maotong multi multitasking OS. Ug ang mobile OS. Sa mobile OS, maon, I think maoni ang pinaka 
famous kay dili man ta halos dili man ta majority sa ato wala man nila gamit og large scale data processing systems or di kaya early mainframe systems nagamit magayo ta og kuan wala man kita nagamit og modern desktop operating systems pero kuan sa karon mas famous na manggod ang lap mas mas famous na manggod ang cellphones androids or smartphones pero ang high performance servers or supercomputers dili na siya or dili siya super famous sa tuwa dili kay na siya uh, majority sa ato wala na gagamit og supercomputers majority pud sa ato wala na gamit og cloud computing platforms and then majority pud sa ato wala na gagamit og medical equipment or maski industrial control systems pang business related na siya so sa ato majority sa ato whether kuan bata ordinaryong ordinary yung ta or bata or something like that nagamit tag smartphones or tablets android and ios or iphone os so kumbaga kining sa mobile os tama lang din naman na user friendly siya pero diri di naman sa side sa multitasking os na user friendly sa kuan man ni laptop or sa internet di ba multitasking, mag-multitask. Ako gani sa laptop na ako last 2022 and even though last year and this year kita naman na ako na makamultitask ko dito. Pwede kong mag-search sa Google, pwede kong mag-search sa YouTube, pwede kong mag-ask the question sa ChatGPT. Mag-Google search ra ka. Pwede ka mag-Google Chrome na ay mga dula po dito sa kuang laptop. Kaya lang ah, uh, kailangan pa ma-download kaya lang ang problema mong good kay na siya limitation na siya free trial nakatry ko o um, dula o kung itong dula atong kuan ninja ninja frenzy ba pangal ato basta kuan nag nagtry po ko o download o GTA nagtry ko download o Another pa na applications, kaya lang kailangan pagbayad. Pero, makamultitask ka sa imong laptop. And, sa tulong katuig, uh, I mean, 2022, 2023, and 2024, sa laptop na ako, naga MS Paint ako. Pero karon delete na ako active sa MS Paint. <coughs> <coughs> magiging active lang ko kuan lang naman kanang uh, depende na po na sa mood na ako alright okay next is operating system architecture the kernel the kernel is the core component of an operating system that directly interacts with hardware it manages system resources and provides essential services okay System calls. System calls are interfaces between user programs in the kernel. They allow programs to request kernel services. Oh, so ano siya pag-explain? Ambot lang. Components of an operating system. Process management. Handles process creation, scheduling, synchronization, and termination. Next, memory management. Allocates and the allocates memory to processes using techniques like paging and segmentation. Next, file management creates, deletes, and manipulates files and directories. Next is I.O. or input-output management. Controls communication between the system and external devices. Next, device management handles device drivers and device allocation. Next, real-world examples. Process management, managing multiple applications running simultaneously on a smartphone. Next, memory management, efficiently using RAM or RAM to avoid system slowdowns. Next, file management, organizing files and folders on a hard drive. 
Next is input and output management. Printing a document or transferring files to a US to a USB drive. Na ako USB so oh actually dili man ko always nagaprint no pero I love input output management. I love this. I love my USB. Ang pingan jud ako maayong USB guys kay mahal kayo na siya. Ako ako yung nagpalit ana sa asa ko nagpalit ana gani sa may Gmall. Oo. Okay. Next. Types of OS architecture. Layered architecture. One common OS architecture is the layered approach. This involves dividing the OS into multiple layers, with each layer providing services to the layer above. Typical layers. Hardware layer. The foundation directly interacting with physical components like CPU, memory, and I/O devices. Kernel layer, the core of the OS managing system resources, process scheduling, memory management, file system, and device de drivers. System call interface layer provides a standardized interface for applications to interact with the kernel. Subsystem layer. Handles specific functionalities like file systems, networking, process management, and memory management. Next, last, application layer. User level programs that run on top of the OS. So, mauni ang sample. Maglibog lang yung kaani. Memorize yun, pagkaya na ako ni. <coughs> Ulahin na po ko para makamemorize sa ano eh. Disadvantages, modular design, easier to modify and maintain. Improve security as lower, lower layers are protective, protected from higher layers. Efficient use of resources. Disadvantages, performance overhead, Due to multiple layers, complexity in designing and implementing. Next is microkernel architecture. This architecture moves most of the OS functionality into user space, leaving a minimal kernel in the kernel space. This approach offers better security and flexibility. Components microkernel. Handles essential functions like process management, memory management, and inter-process communication or IPC. Next is user level servers. Provide additional services like file systems, networking, and window systems. Example. Kamo ni bahala mo explain. Kamo ni bahala mag imagine. All right. Advantages: Improve security as most services run in user space. Flexibility as new services can be added without modifying the kernel. Easier to port to different platforms. Ang yana mga disadvantages are performance overhead due to frequent context switching between user and kernel space. Increase complexity in designing and implementing. Next is hybrid architecture. Unsa man ni siya combines elements of both layered and microkernel architectures. It provides a balance of efficiency, security, and flexibility. Okay. Okay. Example. Advantages combines the strengths of both layer and microkernel architectures, offers a good balance of performance, security, and flexibility. Disadvantages increased complexity in design and implementation. Conclusion: Operating systems are fundamental 
to computer systems providing essential services for users and applications. Understanding the different types of operating system and their components is crucial for IT professionals. Okay, kinina po dang next. Okay, sorry kayo. Okay. Week 3, Operating System Compounds, Lecture Notes, Process Concepts, Process, An Instance of Program in Execution, PCB, Process Control Block, is a data structure maintained by the operating system for each process. It contains essential information about the processes, state, resources, and scheduling details. Examples of PCB fields I. Process ID, process state, program counter, registers, memory management information, I.O. status, and accounting information. Start po tayo sa process ID. Unique identifier for the process. Next, process state. Current state of the process, whether new or ready na ba siya, running or waiting or terminated, ready na ba siya, Nag, uh, nagkuha na ba siya, nag-run, kailangan pa ba kang mahulat, or kailangan na ba siya i-delete. Muna kong understanding ha. Next is program counter. Address of the next instruction to be executed. Next, registers. Values of CPU registers. Next, memory management information. Base and limit registers for memory allocation. Next, I.O. status. Information about open files and I.O. devices. Next, accounting information. CPU, time, used, resource, usage, etc. Next, process states. New, process being created. Ready, process is waiting to be assigned to a CPU. Morning example, wala po kasabot. Ready queue with processes awaiting to be executed. Running process is currently executing on the CPU. CPU with the process running waiting. Process is waiting for an event. Example is input and output completion. Then next is terminated. Process has finished execution. Whether bug over siya or ready. Nagaran or nag-delete, kini sa side sa pinakababa, waiting, morning diagram sa process states. Process creation and termination. Process creation, system call or library function, example for sa Unix-like systems. Next is allocates resources, PCB, memory, etc. Initializes PCB with process attributes. Creates a new process image. Next is process termination. Process finishes execution normally or abnormally. Okay. Releases allocated resources. Deletes the PCB. Wake up po yan ang study guys. Uy. Mara kong katugon. Thread concepts. Thread. Lightweight process shares address space with other threads of the same process. Multi-threading multi -threading. allows a process to have multiple threads of execution sharing the same address space. Morning sample. Benefits. Increased responsiveness can handle multiple tasks simultaneously. Resource sharing. Threads share the same memory and resources. Economy. 
Creating threads is generally faster than creating processes. Utilization of multi of multi core processors can take advantage of multiple cores. OEM study ways. Eh, katugon kay ko. Hi, just ko katugon ko guys. Lami ang matulog, uy. Hindi ko kapang way up, uh, pero lami kay mang way up, lami, lami na kay matulog, lami kay mong higda. Ay, aha ka, uy, karun pa yung kuka, karun pa ko giduka ba, karun pa ko nagluya. Okay. Asa namang kuha ni? Next is challenges. Shared data problems. Race conditions. Deadlocks can occur. Synchronization issues. Needs or need mechanisms to coordinate thread activities. Okay. Thread management overhead. Creating and managing threads has overhead. Okay, next, thread implementation, kernel level threads, managed by the operating system, user level threads, managed by the application. Alright, memory, manage, uh, memory management techniques, memory management, efficient allocation and the, allo the allocation of memory to processes, paging, dividing physical memory into fixed size frames, and process memory into pages of the same size, virtual memory, mapping pages to frames using a page table, demand paging, loading pages into memory only when needed. Ay, just oh my god. Sa ano pag-explain, mabuang na ko guys. Page table mapping virtual addresses to physical frames. Kana naka light violet is ko ano siya. Page belonging to process. Ang naka, naka pink, dili po siya exactly red. Page not belonging to processes or process. Segmentation. Dividing process memory into logical segments. In varying sizes, base element registers for each segment. Process with multiple segments. Dere, single process P with single thread. Say meaning ana. Tapos single process P with three threads. Sa left side, isa lang ang thread. Sa right side, tulu ang thread. Nagluya in taon ko eh. Kung sama ni guys, um, last, o sige na lang, di na lang siguro ko mag-upload diri ak, kaya gigiduka dyan in taon ko eh. Pag masakay kong jeep ani unya no, may expect na lang yung kung nga katulog, makatulog yung kung ano sa pag masakay kong jeep. O sige, ano na lang may tabu karon guys. Di na lang ko mag-upload diri as sa sa shrine, sa, sa balay lang ko mag-upload. Kaya kung makatulog ko sa balay, o oh, sige, matulog ko 30 minutes. Half hour nap lang ko. <sighs> Virtual memory. Abstraction of physical memory. Allowing processes to use more memory than physically available. Uses paging or segment segmentation. Advantages, larger address space, efficient memory utilization, protection. Ito mo ni bahala magkuhana ni guys pag understood. Okay. File system concepts. File collection of related data stored on secondary storage. 
file structure, sequential, data ac data accessed sequentially, index sequential, data as accessed sequentially or randomly using an index, direct, data accessed directly by block number. Puya eh. Figure 4 2 Three kinds of files Number Letter A Byte sequence Letter B Record sequence Letter C 3 Or punuan Kung saan understanding nga na Different file structures Okay, next is file operations Create Creates a new file Open Opens an existing file Close Closes an open file Read Reads data from a file Write Writes data to a file Seek Moves the file partner to a specific position Delete Delete sa file. Oh my God, kapuya. Eh. Jesus Christ. Tugon ko.
tugon kay ko guys o sige na lang um, di ko katulog pero nag nagpiyong nagpiyong akong nagpiyong akong mata guys nagpiyong so ano na lang uh, humanap na sa ito ang kuan discussion wala pa week 3 and week 4 sabi na ako baka tulog na yung quadrate so di pa ako katulog di ay kids pain last session turning i-end ito ang vlog bag mag mag bag na lang ko dili sa dili bag sa laptop akong ikuan eh natulog ko kagani ang buntag nang padulong sa odto early early noon Natugon kayo ko guys, uy. Alright. Kalit ako kaduka. Mugawas na ako karon guys. na guys, magawas na ta wait lang nga ang pamasahe sa Jude birthday na Timonik karon kuha na ang edad ni Timonik karon is kuha na 41 years tama, 41 years old na siya gahapon, birthday na ni Lorma may nalang kagitagaan kung kuha sa Uncle Bal ang nagkuha na to pag iahak lagi kay Nahubog sa kagabi ig. Wala ko nang expect ngayon nga itong naitabo. So tara na guys.
lahapit naman yung mag-start ang Nisa diri ah. So, mugawas na ta para napot respeto po diri ah, guys. Respeto na lang po sa Nisa diri. Wala lang ko nag-attend og Nisa diri kay last time nag-attend ko og Nisa English sa assumption na lang. Alam mo sa aring araw, so di na ko magpayong Let us pray. Lord, in kanan, Lord, itagaan ko ni mong power, Lord, despite nga na ay obstacles po diri, ah, kay medyo nanibago po po diri, ah, kining bag sa laptop, I hope next time, nalang ko yung lesson, ah, ni, kumadala ko laptop diri, ah, sa shrine, <coughs> dapat ibutang siya sa bag na color blue, and, despite nga na ako yung obstacles, ah, uh, I'm still successful sa ko ang journey diri sa to ang tulo ka tulo ka part sa to ang study time thank you kay lord for allowing me to make this happen balag na dismaya at least na ako yung lesson learn through your son jesus christ thank you so much lord amen Tara na guys Wala na ko yung oras Mangita na kong pagkaon dito sa may downtown Downtown na lang sa Goro Naabdan ko kuan guys Giduka ko
yung cellphone nga daan gi-off lang na ako Exit Shrine of Infant Jesus. Nag aso aso. Di kong palit ang puto bong bunga kay magtipid sa ako kwarta. Char. Magtipid pa tayo kwarta dahi. So, pa-start na. Mag-start ng misa, guys. Wow, what is that?
3,000 plus. Ito na pag-usap today. August 26. 20, 24. Alright. Bye-bye. 12th station. Alright. Di duka ko. May nalanggani kay nawala ng pagkaduka. Duka on na po kuha ni Uni ako pag sakay kong jeep. Gracia. Bawi lang yung kuugma guys. Okay lang yan. Oh, naman yung tria, guys. Oh my goodness. Uy, nausa naman ni. Eh. Nabaguhan ko dari ang lugar. Hindi mo naman nagibagyuhan. Yabag. Murang magdaibagyo dari. Kuan bag tornado char possible ay that is impossible all right
wala pati to diri ah Sige kasi nitaw diri ah Sa kan diri bang ano bang putol Nay uban laya nga dahon Nay uban nga alive dead alive na tanom naka ingani siya o oh. asiguro ah, sa wire manggudra o ah, oh. ako ay posted rin nga katumbahon giahak na First station. Four thousand plus. What are we set for today? A August twenty sixth, twenty four.
Alright guys, dapat ipa-4. Thank you for watching all.